We have had candy, ice cream on the show, popcorn, this is fantastic. Summer is here, it's the perfect time to start planning a movie night party for your family and friends and invite the neighbors over. Tanya Memmi's here, she's got some wonderful, great ideas to make your party a big hit. You know how I always have your back? Yeah. I gotta take all this mess off the side oh, of your chin. Yeah, I got a whole bunch of salt <laughs> Do and popcorn. I have some on yeah. my back too. Okay, enough that. pretty for television. You're enjoying it. All right. Oh no, it's so, good. So, Tanya, show us how it's done. This is fantastic. Know, we have everything cool. out here. Uh -huh. So, what have you done out here? Okay, so the first thing you want to keep in mind when you're having your party is you want to pick the right spot. So, pick a spot in your house that's kind of cozy. Mm -hmm. You want to remember lighting because once that TV goes on, you want to make sure that the light is right. That you can actually see your TV. Not sure. there's no reflections, that kind of thing. And you want to you want to be able to bring out some furniture. Furniture, so we have plenty of space, nice and cozy. And right here, we're playing some classics oh, on our TV. We love I that. I love that. All right. And so you provide the right equipment. So you brought our our big flat screen TV out here. Yes. Yeah, so the cool thing. Okay. You can literally wheel your television set outside, and you can you know, use a um, a long cord if you choose mm -hmm. to. If you have to use that, then make sure you put some tape so nobody trips over it. You can rent a projector on a wall. There's all different things. You can also some nice projectors. That beautiful I've, yeah. projectors. I love Van Johnson, Elizabeth Taylor. Oh my goodness, look at this. Old movie. Oh, look at there. Oh my, oh. Is that uh -oh. Ava Gabor? Can we just watch? Oh my goodness. Let's just watch. Watch. I know. Let me oh my. We'll get right back here. to you in a second, Tanya. That's, that's it's amazing. either Zsa Zsa or Ava. I can't tell. Okay. <laughs> All right, so obviously you want to get a good movie, yeah. right? You want to get a great movie. So when it comes to the movies, I love this. I always tell my guests to bring a movie of their choice, and then when they walk in the door, they put it in a box, and we either pick one, mm. or you guys can duke it out. What would you pick? Uh, well, I'd do one of those. I would either do Grease, because that's fun to watch, but I love The Breakfast Club, which I think is just a fun movie to watch for everybody. Yes, you know? and everyone loves that. Classic, yeah. Okay, so we have that, we have that, we have our movies, and now a oh, place to sit. That's right, so here we have this outdoor patio furniture. This is awesome. And look you who's there, it's Jesse and Jesse Kim. Jesse and Kim. Oh, yeah. There's Mark. <laughs> look at Can look I at Kim. Oh, so she's, odd. Kim's so eating good. again. Oh. oh, wow. Okay. Fantastic. So we have our comfortable place to yeah. sit. Yeah, right. you kind of want to think outside the box. Take, if you have a nice couch, bring it outside. I mean, I moved my, you, you were telling me earlier you used your dining room table. I took my dining room oh. table, set it under a tree with beautiful flowers on the table and, and, and chairs. It we was did so that all stuff. the time. Of course, we were in college. And it was a lazy boy that reclined back. <laughs> no, no, it whatever awesome. it is, Take our, make yeah. it comfy. Use right. your furniture mm -hmm. from your inside of the house. Bring it outside, add Perfect. some blankets, some pillows. You want to make it really cozy. Okay, the most important thing. Yes. Food. Yeah, you got to have to. Yeah. So snacks. let's go okay. here yeah, by our snacks. Snacks, because you're so, watching a movie. You don't want it to be like, here's a platter of. I want an In-N-Out burger. Yeah. <laughs> no, but we can do candy. Yeah, no, okay. Well, we can right. order it too. But okay. So I am a huge popcorn lover. So I love to have tons of popcorn. These two recipes. This is a rosemary and parmesan popcorn. It's on our website. Um, this is a buffalo ranch. No it's way. Like buffalo ranch seasoning Coloring. butter. You mix it all up. There you go. And this one is like kettle corn. Oh my gosh. These delicious. two recipes are on our website. So oh. you definitely want to taste those. Mm. Now, I love to make this oh. beautiful and colorful and fun. I love this candy. It's it's Red Vines Fruit Vines mm. Bites. And it's from I the love company these. Red Vines. You know our famous. Oh my licorice. God, I love these. We love these. They're so chewy. They're low in calories. They're they're low in... in um, well, they, they're filled with well, tons of fruit. Yeah, they don't have like that sugar that makes you crazy. Right, exactly. It's so good. Mm. And they're just, they taste mm. absolutely, absolutely amazing. They're low in fat, they're made with no preservatives, which is always a plus. So you can feel great eating these. And over here, you just want to add some other oh, colorful candies to make your candy bar look great. And it's not a candy bar. When I do this, candy. I have to make bar. sure it's tall enough because Fred will eat it all. <laughs> really? My dog will eat, go plow through this. <laughs> You know him. I mean, he just will. You know what would be nice, though, so our guest leave? Yeah. We can make bags out of these and send them home with um, treats. Which is another great idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just get a little plastic bag, twist tie, and send mm -hmm. everybody home with some candy and popcorn. Find all of Tanya's wonderful summer movie ideas and her party tips on our website. I got to get this recipe. My son Kai like would love one. this. This, he, is, uh, my this is spicy. I think this is Kim Douglas. Um, I has like these. Want to start a food fight. I'm okay, on our on our Pinterest page, Pinterest.com forward slash home and family TV. It's right there on your screen. Next up, I'm gonna show you how to create 3D dimensional wall art using some of the favorite photographs that you already have. Don't go away.